Guess what? <clears throat> yep, I lost again. Obviously, my team sucks. So I had to make a drastic measures. I made a trade. I got rid of my best player on my team, Le'Veon Bell. I was really sad to see him go. I loved him. He was a great guy. But I got to shake things up. My team is, what, 2-6. Two and 2-6. Two and six. Two and six, there's only, at what, six games left? So I'm already going to the toilet bowl. I might as well try and do something about it now. So Teddy and I made a trade. I gave him Le'Veon Bell and Doug Baldwin. And he gave me a struggling Randall Cobb and a rookie TJ Yeldon that looks promising. So we'll see how that works. Anyhow. Let's look at this game we just got done with. We have me getting beat by the Swifties, who's on vacation. So he didn't even need to, he like went on vacation and still beat me by six, which was good enough. Corey likes, man, here for beer, you have had a crazy year. You either win close games or you lose close games, but you've had a lot of close games. A lot of close games. And you lost this close game, thanks to Chris Johnson and his butt-rolling long run that gave him the win, basically. That one where he was tackled, but he wasn't on the ground yet. Yep, so here for beer, you lost. Pocket Rockets, you're on a little bit of a skid. Is that two in a row for you that you lost? That is. That is two in a row that you lost. That's a bummer. But you played Wine of Diamond. He's a... Uh, Got a pretty solid team this year. Pretty solid, thanks to Devontae Freeman. And I guess Chen, Chan Card, you know, the West guy for the Chiefs who stepped it up. So, that means Dirty Engines beats Doodoo, -Doo, even though Doodoo -Doo put up 155 stellar points. Gets punked by Dirty Engines, 179 to 155. I'm so sorry. And you know what that means? Dirty Engine, our defending champion, is now tied for first with Pocket Rockets. I don't like returning champions to do well, unless it's me. Uh, Pink Taco gets plugged by Beats by Ray. Beats by Ray, 151-136, thanks to 47 points from Tom Brady. How does Tom Brady get 47 points when... He was basically getting shut down all the first half. Unbelievable. Great pickup, Jeremy, with Stefan Diggs. I kind of wanted him, and I didn't bid enough to get him. So you took him from me. I really could have used that receiver. Or did you bid on him? I just, I think I did you bid on him, or did I just forget to pick him up? I don't remember. Either way, nice. Captain Insanos crushes Teddy, 151 to 117. Thanks to a late pickup. I saw that. You picked up the Rams defense, which got you 24 points. Nice pickup by the Rams defense. If I would have saw that out there, I would have took it. I just wasn't paying attention. So, as we sit, there is, like I said, six games left. Beats by Ray in first place at 5-3 and three with the Swifties, Captain Insanos, one game behind, tied at 4-4. Four and four. And here for beer is only two back at three and five. Then we got the other two divisions. We're basically two teams are, in, are 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 you know shooting it out. The other two teams are pretty much going to the toilet bowl. Pink Taco is one game back from Wine and Dynam, seven and one and six and two. And the other two teams two and six. So that's it. Pickums. One week left of the Pickums. And I have a two-game lead somehow. I don't know how I did this. Somehow I got a two-game lead. I hope I can hold on. Last week of the Pickums, this week, and we start over. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Yeah, let me do some projected scores here. The computer says that Wynum Dynam is going to crush Captain Insanos, which he will. Well, you know what? I don't know. And Santos will have all Sean Jeffries, Big Ben back. They'll have Jeremy Hill. 
I think it's going to be a lot closer than he thinks, but I think Wyoming and Ben will still win. Dudu is projected to get beat by beats, beat down by the Ray, which I would agree. 150 to 137 is what it says. Here for Beer versus Pocket Rockets. Now, this could be Here for Beer's best chance to win. Here for Beer or Pocket Rockets will not have Allen Robinson, who's been pretty pretty solid for the last, what, two or three weeks. Unfortunately, he's got Tyler Eifert and Aaron Rodgers and Duke Johnson. So, you know what? I'm sorry, Here for Beer. I, I think Pocket Rockets is going to beat you. Swifties projected also to get beat up by Dirty Engines. 140 to white now 112 plus oh we'll say you play Latavius Murray, so that's 125. 140 to 125. Hmm. You know, I really think I smell upset here. I think Swifties are gonna beat the Dirty Engines. It's my guess. Sorry. Pink Taco. To squeak by, Corey likes peanuts. And, yeah, I don't even think he's going to squeak by. I think he's going to crush him. I think Pink Taco is going to put Ryan in his, and put him put him in his place. He's going to get killed. And finally, Teddy, with his new team, versus me and my new team. <laughs> Too bad the guy he gave me is on a bye, so I have no Jordan Reed. And no TJ Yeldon. So, I don't think I'm going to win. I am pretty sure you're going to beat me. That's it. That was quick. That was only seven minutes on what? All right. Go Royals! Oh, I can't wait for this game. This is going to be such a stressful week, but it's going to be so fun. All right, guys. Have a good week!